good day to my subscribers this video is all about how to select pump for your pipe network system now this problem already we first analyzed it with a fixed head a fixed head pump now having done that with a fixed head pump and a control flow within these three lines now we're able to now let's let me see we click the calculate button it's out so now so it's solved then if you look at this this is a pump head now the flow rate the flow rate now if you add all the control flow you have 238 so we have gotten all this that we needed now we need to now look at um, the pump performance curve of a manufacturer to make selections now but good thing this software has some database where you can collect where you can get information concerning the pump performance curves of um, manufacturers that is stored into the software so now let's go to that point so now let's now make we now need to edit this so for us to do that now this is a fixed head pump so now we need to now change change it but before we do that we'll do save us so that we don't we can we don't we will not change what already we have done although if you want to see how i was able to put up this thing you go to um how to use my flow expert for fixed head pumping to three tanks so there is a video for that so but now what i want to explain here is all about how to select the pipe based on the fact that you have used a fixed head now you know the flow rates what you now need to do is to look at your pipe performance curve and make selection so now before we do that i would first do save us i will save it now i need to change this is not going to be a fixed head pump to three tanks i will now have to change it to um let me say fixed speed let me say fix uh, fixed speed pump let me call it fixed speed pump Six speed pump into three tanks. Now, with this fixed speed pump, you will now have the pump data. You will have the pump performance data where there will be variable flow rate and variable head. Now, so now we haven't saved it as fixed speed because we we'll set it at a particular speed. Then now let, i will just click save so now what i will now do is that i will select the the pump i will select the pump you know this is a set head increase so now this is a particular head now what we're going to do is i will come to this set speed i haven't selected this set speed you see as you select the set speed this icon that is freezed before unfreezed so now we can now select the open we can now select the pump that we can now open the pump database and make selection so we'll go to the pump database open it we'll go to search we need to search for the pump that can be able to deliver as in the we're able to make selections from what we have already gotten already 
Now, we need to change this to liter per minute. Now, the value here is the flow rate, the total flow rate, having used the control flow is 238. Now, and um, the head is in meter, in meter fluid, okay? This should be 20. So let's look, let's click define pump button. Now we now have this one is at 50, 59 efficiency. This is uh, this is just 30, 53. So efficiencies are very low. So this is 19. Okay, only this one that is 20, that is 59. So we'll select this. We'll select this. Then now we'll say select pump. Now we have selected the pump. So now what we'll do, let me go to this graph graph option. I will need to put, if you run it, I will need to have our system call. They prefer oper uh, oper operating region. So we need to also check the preferred operating region. We also need to check the net positive suction head required and the power. Now we'll just save. Now we'll save pump to pipe. So we'll just click save. Now having done this, we we'll now click the calculate button to see what happens. So with this resource, let's look at it. Let's look at the pump. So the head is 22.693. The pump head is 23. The same pressure. So it's okay. And then let's look at uh, now. See the preferred operation, uh, the operating region from here to here. The, if the speed is between this and this. So the 238 falls within this region, so it's okay. Now let's look at the, so it's okay, let's look at the curve. See, it falls within the region, falls within the region, so it's okay. Uh, and the efficiency is 59.1. So it's still okay, and the, the pump head is 22.69. So, with this, you can now ask the uh, manufacturer to send to send. You can even send the this information, this pump data to the manufacturer. The manufacturer will now send the pump to you, so that you will now use it for this particular pipe network, pipe network system. So, and it will be good for it. So now, I can now create the pump sheets. I can say create pump sheets. So let's wait. So this is a pump sheet. This is the information I will send to the manufacturer. Then the manufacturer will now. So this is a pump data sheet that I will send to the manufacturer. The person, the, the manufacturer that is manufacturing this pump. So we look at it and send the pump for us. So now that is it. Now I will now need to close this. But now I also need to also print out my results. I'll just click results. Now I can change the logo. I can delete this logo. Let's say I delete it. I can change it to another logo. Well, let me reset it and bring it back. I can put it to. I can um, erase it and put the, my company logo. I can also change the company. My comp the, this name here to my company name. The project name and uh, the engineer reference. So uh, that is it. So now the title of the pro, the title, the subtitles, and all that. So now I will just click this create PDF report. So let's click it. Um, let's wait for the report to come up. So this is the report. So these are the report, these are the data. So you see, 
the whole thing is here. If you like to see it. So thank you for watching. Please, if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. Do where to hit the notification bell and also do where to also share it. If you like the video, hit the like button so that so the thing will be it will be on its own shared to many other people. If other people will also see the video. Thank you.